Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of D Gaming. Today I'm gonna show you a fun deck which is the Psychic Showdown. I hope you guys enjoy the previous upload of yesterday which is the Disciple of Ra and some top tier decks. I hope you all guys enjoy and have some fun and success on the decks. Feel free to drop your comments down below to let me know what other decks you'd like to see and you know just any comments will be likeable and remember to subscribe to my channel and follow me on my Facebook for more updates and uploads. So without further ado, let's go through the deck that I'm using today. So basically the skill that I'm using is Titan Showdown, so that's why it's the Psychic Showdown. So basically let's just take a look at what does this skill does. So it is whichever player has double or more life points than the other takes double battle damage. So what does this mean? It means that if your opponent has 4000 life points and you have 2000, if you attack him with 2000, it's OTK. You are lesser than him by half and if you deal 2000 damage, it's become 4000. So, so on and so forth, 3000 is 1005. So you know, you have to play your max a bit, more maximatics. I hope you guys all pass your max during the high school days. So without further ado, let's go through the deck list. So this uh, deck is pretty much run by the Overdrive Teleporter. So this is an SR card and what does this card does is this card cannot be special summoned but if it's normal summoned by tributing I can pay 2000 life points to special summon 2 level 3 psychic monster from the deck. So which means that if I tribute summon this card I can pay 2000 life points to special summon 2 level 3 or lower monster which you may summon the serene psychic witch and watch psychic fighter i will go through the effect later so with this you have 2000 lesser life point than opponent which means you can easily perform your otk so next we have power injector if you have one of it on the field once per turn i can pay 600 life points to have all face up psychic type monster gain 500 attack during this turn so this make it more even powerful bit down and with the titan showdown it is pretty much multiple attack so we have one destroyer which this card if it's on the field i can pay 1000 life point to target one set and spell trap my opponent control but if this is the only psychic monster on the deck on the field at the end of the end phrase it will be automatically destroyed so please do take note of that and Serene Psychic Witch, basically, this is a mailing card, so you would like to draw it in the turn, uh, first turn, and set it down, and when it is destroyed, this card uh, is sent to the graveyard. I can banish one Psychic type monster with 2000 or less attack from your deck, and during next standby phase, I can special summon it. So basically, I can mail out more cards with that. So what Psychic Fighter, what does this card is, if this card is summon, normal summon, special summon, I can target one card in my opponent graveyard, place it on either top or bottom of the deck. So which is pretty spicy. And next we have the UR Fear Spell card, the Brain Research Lab. So what does this card do is once per turn, I can normal summon one Psychic type monster in addition to your normal summon or set. So basically you can uh, normal summon 2 monster or you know just summon this and tribute summon this anyway is fine and if successful by doing this double summon I can place one psychic counter on this card and if I want to activate the monster effect I can remove either remove one spell counter on this card or I just pay the life point but the consequences of this is that if this card is destroyed and you have like 2 or 3 counter on this card, you will take 1000 damage for each psychic counter. So this card is pretty OP in my opinion for psychic deck and one AMA just to you know in case you want to go for OTK and you are unable to destroy the back row, you can use this to OTK easily. 2 enemy controller just for back row protection and against cyber angel and two, 3 of this psychic. Cornices 
So this card is when I control a psychic type monster, I can target one card on the field, any of it, destroy it. And if I did, I take 1000 damage, one windstorm for general protection, and I just want psychic rejuvenation. Just in case if I can't OTK him this round, I can use this to give back some spells. So it's more like a uh, technical card, I would say. So let's go on to the highlight. I hope you guys enjoy. And remember to subscribe. It is free to subscribe. Don't be worried. YouTube will charge you for it. And follow me constantly on Facebook and on my YouTube channel for more spicy, fun, and top tier deck. So the first match is against Mai. So let's see what can Titan Showdown do to her. So I'm going first, which is okay for a boy here. Titan Showdown. So I open with a pretty decent draw, Power Injector, Overdrive, Teleporter, Psychonesis, and a Windstorm for protection. So I both set both of them down. I don't want to review them. So it is one of the Gemini deck that I did post out two days ago. So be sure to check that video out. It's pretty fun to play, but too bad. I'm just getting the better of it. Honestly, I've been fighting a lot of players with the decks that I built. So, you know, it's kind of fun if I win it. <laughs> so now I got Brain Research Lab. I turn on my Power Rejector and I special and I do a normal summon with my Overdrive Teleporter. And I just get what Psychic Fighter because I know if I destroy this, this guy here, he will special summon this Dark Storm and I will have big problem. So I use Watch Fighter effect to bring this guy back to his deck. Use Psychonesis to destroy his face down card because I don't know what the hell is that. And just go for the OTK. Did you see just now when I attack? It's 28,000 attack. So you see, this is a very powerful Titan Showdown deck with a very powerful OTK potential. This card is pretty easy to get except Brain Research Lab. If you don't have it, don't worry. You can just use Double Summon or you know, just have a bit more Psychic Monster on the field. If you do have this card, feel free to use them because I mean, we have those cards. Just why not? Just play with it. Follow me on my Facebook and my YouTube. Let me know what other decks you like to see and I will make it happen for you. So next is against the mech, the AG deck. I come up with Windstorm and you know pretty bad hand. I do have Serene Witch. So I just do a face down uh, set because I just want to protect my life point and my fear. So pinning me, I just Windstorm him away. So to defense position, he did not set any card. So now I use Brain Research Lab to do Power Rejector and I use Brain Research Ability to special summon overdrive transporter and I just use the special summon effect and just go for the attack but too bad for him he's GG easy peasy like a cheesy juicy deck so it's a Rex Raptor against a Rex Raptor so we shall see who has a better last laugh basically I'm challenging a dino deck which I think two three days ago I did post one so just check out all my video I have a playlist of them so you know why not if you are free and now it's school holiday for some of you guys just check them out remember to connect to Wi-Fi I do not want you to pay for a 3G or 4G so I just set Serene Psychic Witch which is good enough so he do one set and Dino and I miscalculated because of this Hydrogendo, which you guys will recall from my previous video, the Disciple of Ra, the Tree of a Khan. So, well, he got a battle of me, he attacked me, which I feel very painful on my side. So with Psychic Serene, uh, which effect, I can get one Destroyer out, and I just use Brain Research Lab, but I did not special summon anything because I can always do this, so I destroy the back row first which is a for sale excavation which is good 
So I use Brain Research Lab just to use its ability to overpower the opponent. Because my life point is 2 liter, I can't activate anything. So now it's basically I'm in a losing position with 1100 life point to go. And Power Ejector, Brain Research. I use Brain Research Lab ability to just, you know, stall for one turn, protect my life point, and go for the OTK. Just nice. 18,000 times 2, 3,600. Attack. I hope you guys really like this spicy fun deck. Well, it, to be honest, I don't think it's ex good as my previous two video. So, but, you know, why not? I think Psychic still need more support and more monster card to be more relevant. As of now, it is still, you know, lacking here and there. So I'm against a uh, Maximilian Pegasus with the Mind Skin. So I open with a uh, not a good hand as well, but it's okay. So apparently he's using Summer like that. So I bring Research Lab, send up my Power Rejector, do my Special Summon. And now, I go for the special summon. So I attack, attack, and see that 28,000 in his face because of my life point is lesser. And now he just used powerful rebirth. It's time for the destroying. And he just surrender. He has no luck or no choice against my psychic showdown. Christmas is coming, I hope you guys, you know, are having fun buying Christmas gift. Be sure to stay tuned for more. I may give I may do a giveaway at the later of this month. So stay tuned for more updates. So this is the last replay. He has more life than me, which is always good for me. And this is kind of a troll deck. I think he's playing Cyber Steel if I'm not wrong. Which is okay for a boy, but he end up with this, you know, I don't know. Maybe it's one of my deck that he grab trap, trap card. So I set Serene down because I want to banish more cards. He draw two more hand card on his hand. Tribute to the two. So which is always trashy for a guy. I was destroyed, so I use Psychic Fighter. So I special summon him back to the field. Use his effect. Put one tribute summon. And power ejector. Minus another thousand attack, destroy the face up. But I did a mistake. I I did not attack. So you know, I was like, what? Luckily it's a tribute to the doom. So now 2600. 2600. What a deck. What a gameplay. I hope you guys all enjoy this video. So once again, remember to subscribe, give a like, and leave your comments down below for any other decks that you'd like to see. I'm always open for more concept. I'm not really farming Yami Marik at the moment. So I hope you guys have fun with it. Alright, so have a good day, good afternoon, good night, and signing off, peace.